Hi guys, today I want to cover my devil build. I finally got around to doing RBB and uh, man it works, it works uh, like a charm here on devil. So for those of you who don't know what it is, it's basically an upside down floor that's edited. And I've put a, I'll put a link to guys who have vids on how to do it. Um, I'll quickly try to explain. So this is one of the methods. You can place an edited stair. Um, make sure you have a, an airstrike as one of your gadgets. And you got to place a... Um, uh, cozy campfire so you want to stand on the stair and right about the middle to where you are able to see that the trap can be placed and at that spot you uh, do your air you launch your airstrike and then uh, go and place try placing the trap try spamming it and then yeah it comes upside down i'm amazed i got it first try <laughs> then what you do is you wait for the uh, campfire to run out and then you edit the stair yeah i'm impressed with myself with that usually takes me a while to get it and i got this first try so anyway the build is uh, starting on this end and uh, north place a full floor J block up here and this little recycler I've covered in my ridge uh, tutorial so it's uh, some stairs and wall launches recycling them and then you want to uh, place your RBB all along this ridgy terrain and I think it's connected to this floor. I don't think these floors are holding this RBB, but because remember, um, it's upside down and uh, not necessarily joined to this. And then here's your flinger spot. And what I've done underneath the map, I've got uh, retractable spikes as well. Uh, but I've had cases where uh, a nurse will come stand with the flinger and it's nearly impossible to kill the flinger but the uh, freeze traps uh, keep them at bay the entire wave. You might get one or two uh, throws at the amp but it will take uh, minimal damage. So yeah, RBB along this terrain. I'll just wait for this to run out so I can show you how to edit it. And then yeah, I've got V block. And this is for west, more uh, flinger spot and lobber spots. With uh, free straps and darts. And then up here, three, uh, three drop traps. And they are joined here. So the idea of the pathing is that for north everything spawns and will walk up this ramp. Um, you'll get a few husks walking up here and then I've got drop traps just to reset the AI and they eventually all make their way up here. And up here I've got these uh, wooden uh, blue uh, floor spikes got four impact four impact and then i think these are all three impact and everything gets hit down and gets uh, recycled once they're down and what happens with smashes they will come up here and then fall down and get recycled here 
and if they make it past the first launcher they usually get recycled down here um, I've seen once a smasher even fall with these sound walls I don't have any impact on these sound walls these are just two reload all Dura and these are also reload and Dura wall lights it's to reset the smashers AI um, yeah, I had an odd occasion the smasher fell down and then once he got down here, he takes the uh, the recycler here. So on the west, this path is blocked with uh, cones and stairs. Once again, the cones is for smashers not to get through or to face through. And... Um, this is a um, flinger spot and another flinger spot here and like I've said a V block let's see uh, yeah so there's your upside down floor you go edit it and that's your RBB and be careful when you're editing because sometimes although you edit here it it does not uh, come out like that it may come out like this but yeah that's that's how you do RBB and then your amp design so it's your two arches on this way and two arches here as well and two uh, quarter walls I've had the other low walls here, but lobbers uh, want to throw at them. And then I've got anti airs as well because uh, I found that one stray lobber stands here and throws, but the anti airs counters those throws. Yeah, and then the smasher bridge, mini boss bridge. I'll talk about these tarpets just now. So. You want to come up here three floors out one floor to the right a ramp and then floors going to the amp here and so basically yeah many bosses will, will take the path and uh, come here and teleport between these two uh, tiles here Smashers will come up here, look at the amp and charge at the amp. I've got these tarpets here to also stop them from uh, running and coming down here. So yeah, smashers will continue in a loop and mini bosses uh, on the bridge. So here's a little clip of uh, smashers going on to the bridge and um, a little correction is uh, I've had wave 26 on both sides even not I'll show you guys a gameplay at the end of the clip yeah both both sides survive uh, wave 26 and as you can see smashes just uh, charge the amp and repeat that so um, another way I, I think a good idea to counter the flingers on the north side is to put in uh, upside down walls with those uh, darts like uh, robot smoke has in his immortal valley yeah, so that smashes so all these floors is basically uh, your uh, smasher bridge or miniboss bridge it's also the path for all the husks on the north side and it acts as a lobber shield or flinger shield for the flingers that spawn here then i've got a i've got drop traps and a ceiling electric as well for flingers and darts down here and another spot with uh, 
ceiling electric drop traps and your freeze trap here to reload all dura j block on this ramp and the recycler you have i've got all uh, zero impact to reload and uh, this one is a three impact three or four impact uh, for these ones are for smashers to hit them down and then once they get hit down they walk along the beach and um, yeah i've got more v block here so um i've got the sound wall to to reset the ai because what happens is all the ass will come up and stand here crowding um they may beat on the stair once or twice even if they do break it uh, they will go back to the recycler so this is just uh, to stall them uh, smashers will come out and go through this way come up here face through here in fact you can put cones here for them not to face through and they will come and go to the amp through this way Yeah, I've got some gameplay. Um, I've got wave 26 on the west side. West survives it easily. Easily. Um, north side, I've got some normal gay wave 6. Um, and Devil, uh, Devil is, is unpredictable. I've had instances where, you know, Smashers charge as soon as they spawn. They will charge at this low wall here uh, once I've had a smasher charge here at this um, yeah it's weird so just just watch for these weird weird waves that sometimes uh, happens here on devil but other than that everything works smoothly takes the path gets recycled um, yeah, and like I said, uh, you'll get a flinger who, who gets in a throw or two at the amp, but small damage. And that's, yeah, that's my devil, guys. That's what I've been using. It's expensive, but hey, it works. And compared to what I've had here previously, um, this is, a, is reasonable. So one last thing to mention, uh, on the north side, uh, your assassin has your propane and lobbers They will spawn and immediately take this path And get recycled out And That's all for devil guys Thanks for watching